I'm make a scene uh. too I'm regularly not for y'all None of it matter at the end of all I'm to be seeing the cars Trouble you go to the mental state of the fuck When none y'all say it's a phase Say it's a way of playing how to seek and only What's up guys, 8bit smoke here In this video I'm gonna give some tips How you can get the exclusive emote plus 100k gold only top 100 players will get this reward and if you guys get a top 1k badge it will be in your profile and guys i will give some tips or suggestion if you apply this uh, i'm pretty sure you will uh, you will do better than your previous global tournament i know few tips will be basic and uh, boring but it's really important so the chance of getting an auto loss will be less and the tip number one is make sure to play on best network because think that you are in a bus or train imagine that you are at 10 minutes so you will think that i will reach my station in 5 minutes let's do one battle if you play like that you are not uh, actually trying to get to the top you are just playing the game just because you are getting bored so never do that play when you have time and uh, take your time and play calmly and the second tip is play your comfortable decks and uh, choose the best decks for for example if you guys are playing classic lava lone i'm pretty sure that you will be familiar with any lava decks so even if there's an adjustment uh, to your lava decks try to swap one or two cards don't change the whole deck for example you cannot play a uh, hog rider or graveyard deck you will make so many mistakes so stick to one or two decks guys and the third tip is consider taking a break please because you cannot get straight 25 minutes I, I mean you can get but it will be dependent on luck and matchup and the gameplay uh, so when the global tournament starts there will be 5 days no need to rush because I wouldn't say all the top of good players will play in the first day or last day but I'm gonna tell my experience I started playing when the global tournament was going to end in 1 day 23 hour uh, and the question is after how many battles you should take a break I would say out of 5 battles until you get 20 so do like this after getting 5 wins take a 30 minutes or a 1 hour break and start playing again so by doing like this the chance of getting a bad matchup will be less and after getting 20 wins uh, the chance of getting an exact opponent will be high so never play continuously your opponent will just snipe you for example think that you are playing lava loom uh, your, your opponent will just come up with the elixir golem to get a free win from you because uh, he knows that he will find you again so again uh, that's what that's what i was trying to say just take a break and come back again and the fourth tip is try to avoid losses till 25 or 20 wins so if you get any losses uh, in the early stage uh, it will be really hard to get to top and uh, if you don't get any losses till 25 uh, the, ch the chances of getting this emote will be high uh, if you get 25 wins with good crowns you will get top 1000 bats so if you take a loss just refresh and come back after some time and the fifth tip is mute your opponent so you will not be distracted by your opponent if he spa spams you can just get distracted and you will not be able to focus on your game so just mute your opponent Walking alone, the streets are empty The only thing I can see is my own silhouette I'm getting stronger, step by step The clock is ticking, but there's no time for me I've been flying from town to town
close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't want to waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us. And love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah. No, I don't want to One more thing guys, I was at 26 to 27 wins. You can notice here I am not playing Lava. Uh, he beat me with this uh, bait deck when I was playing Lava and so I checked this Royal IPA. So he had uh, 3, to, 3 to 2 chances I think. Uh, so I was pretty sure that I am gonna face him again. So I didn't snipe him 100%. 100% uh, uh, is nothing but like uh, taking arrows and log and zap and minor poison. So he cannot do anything to my deck so I didn't uh, do that but uh, but I took the best deck from the meta which is the royal giant so it does well against his deck and uh, even if I don't face him I had the confidence to beat any other guy so and he's not playing long bite with the inferno tower if he was playing with the inferno tower I would have uh, substituted lightning to fireball it's just simple guys.
close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. I don't wanna waste what's left. The storms we chase are leading us, and love is all we'll ever trust. Yeah, no, I don't. And the next match I took a break for 30 minutes. I knew that I will not face him again because uh, I beat him twice and he did not add he did not add any chances to play the global tournament. So I switched back to Lava. Uh, as you can see the matchup uh, imagine that if I was playing the Royal Giant uh, normal Royal Giant deck against uh, this against this Royal Giant Barbarian Hut and the Fisherman there's no way there's no way I can beat this and uh, he would have won against me easily uh, with his deck glad that I switched my deck to lava so coming back to this match we both have lost our tower so I noticed that inferno dragon was the main problem to his deck so I tried to save my inferno dragon yeah. I baited his fireball to my skeleton dragon so he cannot go RG even if he goes I can place my barbarians I am going with my lava again and my aim is to kill uh, his electro wizards by using the minor zap arrows he did go with the royal giants but uh, he didn't have enough elixir for fireball somehow i took the took out his electro wizard and his fireball didn't do anything and i got 31 wins at this time i think
close till I get up Time is barely on our side I don't wanna waste what's left The storms we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust and this will be my last battle against a modern guy Cause I knew his deck when I searched that logbait guy This guy also defeated that logbait guy So he must be a really good uh, mortar player I knew that I can beat him but I was not sure was he playing the same deck or any other That's why I was waiting for his move So he finally uh, played his minor I will play my inferno dragon and I knew he was uh, playing the same deck so I went lava in front of the Inferno Dragon because he didn't have any reset cards besides the fireball great defense by him honestly I was expecting a minor at this point I'm shocked that he didn't go minor Once again I will try to build up one massive push and he just spent fireball to my skeleton dragon and uh, all the lava pops are still alive so I went with the miner. He will try to save his tower but uh, he is laughing he knows that uh, game is already over. Yeah. And, I'm, uh, and I'm just going to 3 crowns. I will try to 3 crown but I but I didn't take 3 crown I think so I was happy at this moment so BM'd a little bit and uh, and I got 36 in the world at this point that's it for today, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and a subscribe would be highly appreciated and uh, I will post the season 17 uh, best decks for the global tournament. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video, till then take care guys, tada!